serving is the bullseye marker that I think reflects the life of Jesus the most. For serving is what Jesus taught and modeled. If you look at Mark 10, where he says, I have come to serve, not to be served. That sentence illustrated the whole of his walk upon this earth. And it gives this command, his hope, his instruction for those who follow him to do the same. Do you remember the night before Jesus died? When you read in John's Gospel in the 13th chapter of how he greeted his friends, and then he took a basin of water and wrapped a towel around himself, and he went down on his knees and washed the dirt of the road from their feet. Peter, his disciple, said, Oh no, don't, you can't wash my feet, Lord. And Jesus said, That's what I've come to do. And by learning from what Jesus did, we all learn how to serve. There are a number of ways that we can live out our faith, but I don't know how we could live it out without serving in Jesus' name. So whether that's helping a child to read, or it's serving as a greeter at your church, or whether it's volunteering for a Kairos or some other social justice agency, whatever you do in Christ's name brings him alive and impacts other people with his presence. I think serving is probably the core value of anyone who wants to follow Jesus. And if you've never done it, take a first step to try one thing. You might discover that you are gifted and wired up to do the one thing that will make a difference not only in your life, but to your community and to this world that God so loves. Thank you.